Hey guys, welcome back to an episode of Warp Chaser Does How To. Uh, this is actually kind of a follow up episode to uh, my last episode regarding uh, chess cart filtering. Uh, if you remember, we talked about uh, a chess cart filter system using hoppers. And see here, it's a two hopper system where the my cart goes over the hoppers and it can filter and see if the chest has anything in it and switch it on to a different rail depending on the situation. Um, this is my first uh, attempt at this, and as you see, it's a little bit big from the measurements here. It's a, uh, a 5 by 7 by 3, I believe. Um, really didn't work out all that well in that sense. It may work a lot reliably, but it's kind of big and bulky. So I started doing a little poking around and modifying, and what I came up with is version 2. So what I've basically done here, uh, first of all, I've compacted it a lot more. Uh, these guys are a lot smaller than they used to be. More importantly, though, as you see here, it's now running on one hopper. So we've gone from a two-hopper system down to a one-hopper system, and it's actually designed to fold back on itself, so it helps compact the size a little bit. Same concept still applies here, in that whenever a chess card goes over the system, if it has an item in it, it's going to switch the track, run down the side here, and put the item back in. And again, this is simply an easy way to separate empty carts from full carts. Um, there's two different versions I did here. The only real big difference to them, honestly, is simply um, one is a, a two-block uh, two drop uh, versus a one-block. And I prefer the two-block one simply because it's a lot more reliable. As you can see, it flows through just fine, whereas the one-block high one tends to kind of lag about a bit, and it's not real reliable about getting going again. So... Uh, that's not the best in the world. I'll just give you guys a quick view of what I've done here uh, for Redstone. Again, very simple concept of a uh, comparator to check the hopper, and then that's actually running power through this birch here. Uh, one side here, up to the um, or the orange wood, I can't remember the name of it now. <laughs> uh, this actually powers the uh, switch rail, and then the spruce over here is what powers the uh, rail once the uh, cart's been filled back up. So this system here, again, this is the one high uh, drop for the cart. Um, it's great that it's only one high, however, as you can see, because of the way the redstone runs, it's a, um, a little deeper in size here. And I'm sure that you can probably find a way to compact redstone just a little bit more. But I'm not really concerned with it because, again, I'm not real fond of this style. This one here is the uh, two high drop here on a fold back. And again, same concept as before. You got the comparator on the birch line here as main power. And then you've got the um, acacia. That's what it is acacia wood powering the switch rail. And then you've got the spruce here that powers the actual main rail. So, real nice system, nice and compact very easy to deal with. Uh, so that's the uh, version 2 of the uh, system. Uh, what can you use this for? I actually have some ideas. I'm going to uh, keep them to myself for the moment here until I get them spec'd out, but uh, a little sneak peek there. <laughs> um, it's just a great way to, again, to uh, separate uh, carts. Um, I'm doing it in this case for empty carts versus full carts. However, the system can be adapted to actually filter what's in the cart. So there's a little hint for you. Uh, hopefully I'll have that uh, how-to out sooner, sooner than later. As always, I appreciate it. Uh, please leave comments down below. If you have any ideas, input, I always love to hear them. Of course, I'd love to get a like from you. It helps promote my channel. And uh, with that comes new people and, and new input, which I always love. And of course, if you enjoy these uh, how-tos or enjoy my uh, server play series, please feel free to hit the subscribe button. Um, I'd love to get... Uh, uh, more people on and uh, and be able to yeah, show a lot more videos so <laughs> I always enjoy that uh, I appreciate it as always if you guys have any questions and curiosities uh, aside from the YouTube channel I do have my Twitter account which is uh, Warped Jester MC as well as of course you can go on to BottleRocketGaming.com and uh, hit up the forums there uh, as always I appreciate it and uh, well, have a good one Thank you.